Hello again, everybody. I'm Chris from WiseCleaner.com. Today's video is about how to recover deleted files in your Windows computer. If you delete some files and empty the recycle bin unintentionally, there is still a good chance that you can get these files back. We are got a new software called Wise Data Recovery. Now I will guide you step by step on how to recover these deleted files. The first step is to act quickly and try your best to use the computer as little as possible to avoid overwriting the lost data. If you have read some relevant tutorials, this would say go to www.com, download and install some data recovery software, run the software, you get your files back. Happy ending! But there is one potential problem with this. All these operations you do on your computer, you open the website, you download and install the software, your computer is writing data onto the hard drive, which means there is a chance that it may override the lost data. To be very honest with you, even reading from the disk may override portions of the deleted files. A more professional and secure way would be to take the hard drive out and connect it to another computer. Then scan the hard drive with wise data recovery installed in the computer. But in the real world, most of us would not do that. We don't want to go through so much hassle. So what are we going to do? I got a solution for you. Wise data recovery has a portable version. You can download the portable version to a USB flash drive and then plug this drive to the original computer and run software, so that you can reduce the chance of overwriting the deleted data. Now give me a few seconds, I will demonstrate how to do it in my computer. First off, download the port for version of Wise Data Recovery onto your USB flash drive. Go to wisecleaner.com. Open the download center. Right here, Wise Data Recovery. Click Portable Version. To save time, I downloaded it onto my USB flash drive in advance. Just one quick reminder what you are gonna download is a compressed file. So you gotta extract it. Now I'm gonna pull this USB flash drive out and connect it to the computer that I need to recover the files from. Alright, the USB flash drive is plugged in. Right here. In this computer, I deleted a video called Gundam Style on F drive. And I have already emptied the recycle bin. Now I'm gonna recover it. First things first. Open Wise Data Recovery, the portable version. Then choose the drive. I'm gonna choose F drive and click scan. You can see the scanning result listed in detail. You can choose the file type to narrow down the search result or type in the keywords of the file. And right here, Thai Gunnam stuff. One thing I really like about this software is in the process of scanning delete files, it also analyzes the possibility of recovering them. Then it shows you the recoverability of the files before you decide whether to recover them. Here is just good. It means there is a big chance that I'm gonna recover it. Check it and hit recover at the bottom. Then you are prompted with a window asking you to choose a drive to store the recovered file. You will have to choose another drive in order not to override the delete file. I'm gonna choose E drive. OK. Now the recovery is finished. Click OK. Here is the recovered file. Let me play this video. Alright, it remains intact. As you can see, it's real simple to recover files with wise data recovery. Now I want to conclude a little bit. 
The moment you realize you delete some files unintentionally, you should act fast and perform a recovery immediately. I suggest you keep wise data recovery as a must have in your computer before you lose any files, or keep the portable version in your USB flash drives. And you should back up your data on a regular basis, no matter what you use. An external hard drive, some cloud storage services like Google Drive, Dropbox, anything you like. And last, I have two reminders for you guys. The first is do a complete search of all your storage devices before you actually use wise data recovery. I mean, if you moved a file from one drive to another and forgot about it, the data recovery software won't get you anywhere. It just can recover the latest files, no files that have been transferred. If you're not sure whether you have deleted the file, please do a complete search of all your storage devices before actually using wise data recovery. The second is, if you are using a Dream-enabled solid-state drive inside your computer, the deleted files can't be recovered, because data cannot be overwritten onto flash cells. To run the data, the contents of flash memory must be erased first. The moment you delete the file in an internal solid-state drive, the drive erases this file immediately. But Dream is only supported on internal solid-state drives. So if you delete a file from a USB flash drive, external solid-state drive, or SD card, the file could be recovered. So that's how to recover deleted files. Hope you liked this video. Feel free to leave comments. See you next time.